All right, so I want to go over a quick demonstration of how to export a character and how I have the character set up to get into Unreal. So for this character, I have the skeleton and the mesh are the only two things I'm actually going to need. And if you look over here in the outliner, I have my skeleton outside of the basic uh, setup where the, all the rig is set up. I, I pull the joints out. Originally, the joints are in here. I'm just put them back in there. Originally, the joints are in here and they're hidden away. You know, for the animators don't mess with it. The only problem with this is when I export it out in Unreal, it uh, tends to take everything. And the original way it is intended to export it is it, it deletes all the data and you know reconfigures it a certain way but for the way I like my workflow to go I like to take this out so whenever I'm working with the, most of the rigs I work with I can take the rig the joints completely out of the hierarchy here and everything still works as normal it still scales up and everything else and the way I export my skeletal meshes is I select the joints right click into an open area to select the hierarchy of those joints then I shift uh, select the mesh and once those two things are selected I open up my game exporter go to file game exporter and once that is open it usually opens up to the default window which is under models and normally you'll have select export all you want to make sure you go to export selected and then uh, for the most part you go triangle or triangle and binormals smoothing rope skinny blend shapes don't necessarily need to have it uh, and I have the input connection media is normally turned on and not easy to turn that off just because it puts a lot of X stuff in there that I don't want and I make sure I have my path set up and then also the name of my skeletal mesh and once those things are set then you just simply export it out. I already tested it out before. It will export that information out, and now you're ready to go and uh, do your animation exportation as well, and to put onto this model. So one thing I do want to note is the way I set up my animation files is I usually have all my animations referenced in the rig. So basically, I would have a blank folder or a blank folder a blank file and I'll go to file create reference I would add that reference in and then here as you can see in my outliner that these are referenced files in now and then when I go to do my animations I only select the skeleton right click select hierarchy then I proceed to game exporter but I go to animation clips uh, clip on here to set a name type in whatever name and then the same exportation things apply except for I don't need media you just need to make sure your animations are baked so it can bake it every key and then you set your path and if you want a prefix you set that as well and that's how the animations are set so that they can play on the corresponding rig when you set them up in Unreal Okay, so that is it for this, and this, like I said, quick demonstration of all this. If you have any questions, just leave a comment and let me know. All right.